The girl who would later assume the pen name of Ayn Rand was born in Tsarist Russia on February 2, 1905, as Alyssa Rosenbaum. Her father owned a pharmacy shop, and her mother was a homemaker and socialite. Young Alyssa was an intense and bright child who taught herself to read at the age of six. Soon after, she was learning French and devouring detective stories in the children's magazines her mother bought for her. During a family trip to England, walking down a London street, Alyssa spied a colorful poster showing gaily dressed showgirls in a musical review. Back in her hotel room, she made up stories about those dancers and told them to her younger sisters, who listened raptly. Suddenly a thought struck her. This is what writers do. All the time. And she knew her course was set for life. She wanted to create stories about people and events she could admire and look up to. I decided to be a writer at the age of nine, Rand recalled in later life, and everything I have done was integrated to that purpose. It was an immensely important choice for her, and for the world. It would lead her to flee her native Russia, to master the English language, to become a best-selling novelist with the publication of The Fountainhead, and then Atlas Shrugged, to defy mainstream public opinion on the left and the right, to create a new philosophy called Objectivism, and to forge a controversial legacy that's still hotly debated today, many years after her death.